So she didn't have to go anywhere. Were you the librarian? No, we didn't. There were two librarians in Carnegie. Hmm. Did they just rent the space then? I don't even know what the space was. Just my mother, you know. Well, somebody must have asked them at the Carnegie, you know, to be in a house and whatever that was. It was a Kenny Smith. We remember her because long after she was very, you know, very good friend. She had a younger sister with the way of and the things that she sent home that she didn't want, I could wear. Like the bells and really beautiful and sweet salmon, deep green shade, you know, that's like the seventh grade. That's where all the great stuff You didn't have to wear a uniform to go to school? No. They lived in the place where Dad and Barry did. That was their home. That's a beautiful yes. home. Yes. I was out there. Oh, that's the end of that. No, I don't have that in this one. What kind of games did you play? Pardon? What kind of games did you play when you were a kid? Did you have snowball fights? You were too nice of a kid. We had what uh, wasn't in the snow, but it was in an old lot. We didn't go to a playground. We, there were plenty of like there was a cabbage patch they called it across the street, and then uh, Apple Patch. The people came from Apple that lived there. And that's oh yeah. But uh, no, the, the flying Dutchman. Somebody made it for us. Some man or maybe a couple of men. Go and you got on cheater. it like it would be like a cheater totter, but no, you went I'll around this way. Oh. Somebody went in the middle and gave you, you know, a good start. Uh -huh. And then you run out. I didn't run out fast enough. And that's why I had this scar right here. Uh -huh. I get hit right in the head. Oh. <coughs> Did it knock you down? I wasn't even supposed to be out that day. My shoes were thin and it was cold. There wasn't any snow, but... So my sister Anne was taking care of me, or she was sick. I came out, came in all bloody. Oh God! He gave me. Yeah. Uh, What's that? We were at the park. Uh huh. And I was the one. Oh, and we were having a water yeah. balloon fight. He got me right in the head. Uh huh. Ricky got you right in the head. Yeah, it was a lovely one. Whoa! This fell on the ground. Where's your grandma? She I never threw a water balloon. Have you? Mommy, right in the way. Right. We're interviewing. What about those shoes on that picture in your dress? Anna, Why don't you want I've been talking show? about that because Why I have them right in my hand. That's another thing. My sister Ann was with me, and she wanted me to get something in her scrap. Like, uh, <laughs> like a Mary Jane to go with the dress. And that's what Ann was I like the that you got. And I like The shoes were more like what? What were the shoes like? You can't get your gut. Oh. But, yeah. How many little boys did she have? Five. Five. And how many little girls? Three. Three. Oh. And Grandma was the baby. She was. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's right. How many brothers did you have? Two. And then we had, there was five of us girls. Wow. That's a lot. What were all their names? I've never, I've never heard about the names of your sisters. Well, although her right name was Mary. Yeah. Sister Mai, the 
and I'm safe. And I'm safe. Mary, Margaret, you got a Mary and a Margaret? Yeah. Oh, and then Mary was Mary uh, Magdalene. Oh. Mar Margaret Veronica. Now, my dad's mother was Nancy Veronica. Yeah. That must have been, what was so popular around that I time? Don't know. Hmm. Must have been something. Yeah. And then what was your mom's name? Bridget. Bridget. What was her middle name? Elizabeth. Oh, that's pretty. And then what was um, your husband's mom's name? Ellen. Ellen. Uh, Ellen. Helen? Because that's how I think I got my middle name. I hope it's Ellen because my, <laughs> my name's Jane Ellen, so they named me after her, I think. Unless I'm supposed to be Jane Helen. We'll have to find that out. Well, Jake has one, too. Meg is her middle name. Ellen. Margaret Ellen. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I'm very... Oh, look. <laughs> you want to get up now, huh? You pay a lean on your back. You got certain stuff, huh? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Standing up. Okay, so you have all the family history going here. Right? Well, we got a few things. Does have any brothers and sisters? Cousin Pat. Oh, you're talking about John and John and Mike. Yeah, Cousin Pat. Uh, Pat's father. Pat McDonald. Uh, George, right? Pat. Oh. Pat McDonald. And then she was father. Eddie. So they're oh, that's right. Okay. All right. Yeah. And then Bonnie. Yeah. And then Bonnie. In fact, that's when I, I met Dad, too bad. I knew Dad before. When we were at the park, and he said, Do you know my brother, Honey? Honey? That's what they called him. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's, that's what they called him, Honey. Uh, Uncle Honey. Uh, the kids, uh, Jason and Allison, they get a good kick if I call Peter Honey. And I said, That's not real funny. My dad was yeah. Honey. Yeah, he was Honey. Well, they thought you were saying Heine. Honey. Honey. Oh. No, they get, they get all the people. Um, you, um, you met his brother first? You knew him first? I knew Pat, yeah. Was he in your grade or something? No. He had to be in a group that he was in at one time. Oh. He would take you home or wherever you were. Yeah. He was so then he introduced you. Yes. David, I need some help. I have to get my grill from here in the garage to like the backyard. I don't know. Can't get it no. But I think if I go to the garage door that way, Get a picture of me helping. What are you want to go for a walk? You want to go for a walk? Wait, 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 Peter suggested I would stay back around the corner, not let anybody see. So Margaret Mary, myself and the... So she had no idea that you were coming. Oh. It was a surprise. So when Margaret Mary got in there, then Peter must have come out to get me. All I can remember is how terrible your mother couldn't get her breath. She kept going, oh, oh, oh. Die. Are you filming? Uh huh. Who's that? Oh, Kira. Yeah, why don't you ask Kira, um, Grandma a question that you want to know about? Anything um, you want to know about? She's telling. She's under truth serum. So. What did she just? Um, what story did she just tell? Her first trip out to California. She scared the heck out of mom. Mom wasn't oh, expecting oh, her. Oh, oh. She only thought Margaret Mary was. And then uh, Peter Jude was with you also. Yeah, yeah. And you flew out, right? Yeah. I don't know. One time we came by uh, Domer by a train. Mm. Yeah. I don't know if that's first time. I want to know about the second time you ever come here. <laughs>
That's great, Karen. The funniest thing that happened on Mom's wedding day. Remember that? Anything funny time. happened? I remember it was funny, yeah. <laughs> well, that was a great day. So how skinny do you want to get, Karen? How skinny you want to see me? <laughs> Don't move a muscle. What's Jane doing? I'm filming. We're interviewing Grandma. You can ask her any question you want. My life history, I think. Oh, really? Oh, it's yeah. Yeah, hamburgers, bud. And yeah. salad. Are you guys going to be a party? It's not looking good. I mean, we might, we might not. We don't have babies on Monday. Dave, we have a Well, grandma's available. Yeah, my brand new shoes. Well, I could probably stick around for a little bit. No, it's not that important. I mean, maybe we will. I mean, maybe we will, maybe we won't. Well, Edson, will we leave us here? Okay, I need you in the picture. Get over there. Can you ask grandma? Oh, great. Yeah, You're real cooperative. Okay, how is, um, my mom is a baby. Very, very good. Very. Well, come on, we want dirt. Really? <laughs> I, what would she like as a... That I never could lay a hand on her. Yes, I think. What would she like as a toddler? Can you remember? No, she was good. How about in grade school? And very helpful. Huh. Was she clumsy? Huh. Okay. Grandma, we want dirt. <laughs> we want something we can um, blackmail her with. Huh. Did, she, did she know the Ten Commandments when she was supposed to? And the the, the um, Apostles' Creed? Did you have to practice with her? Do you remember that? No. Nope. Hmm. All right, who was her first date with, you know? Do you remember her first date? What she wore? Was she excited? Not a clue. Yeah, and I can't mention names. I don't remember. I, there was a Ray Evans, but that was, I think that was in high school. Mm-hmm. Queen of the Crown, you know that. Yeah. Yeah, she won't let us forget that. Okay, what was the what was the funniest thing one of your kids did? If you can remember. Or who was the cutest? Margaret Mary was coming down with the, the mumps or something. And I said, well, you don't have to go to school today. Pat only heard that he was on the landing. He hadn't come down. He said, half it up and give me something. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't know what was going on. He didn't care. He just wanted to stay home. Half it up and give me something. What's the funniest thing that happened to you on this trip? Losing your wheelchair? <laughs> But I'll tell you, it makes you think, well, the next time you'll be sure that there'll be a claim check out. No matter what they thought. Yeah, they could put a, put a claim check on you. <laughs> well, is that Allison? I don't know. She was kind of quiet out here. Whether she was chilled or cold or something. calling him honey, everybody called him honey, okay. Now how did he earn that name? They all had nicknames, that old crowd that we went along. And honey, because he was so sweet? We know their really first names. Yeah. The Brownie, there was a Duke, you know, the, like the Brownie Lavelle, and Luke Pat, and Mickey the Buzz, another gift. What was your main nickname? Did you have one? Uh -huh. Oh, the girls didn't get them? Hmm. But uh, this uh, Helen, she lived close to where there was a fire one, one night. And, you know, like, like two houses down the block or something. So she was at, on the windowsill leaving out, and Dad was on duty that 
that night, and she sees him going up the ladder. She yells, you go, honey. <laughs> and her husband was really jealous. He said, get in out of there. <laughs> call the fireman, honey. Helen said, everybody calls him, honey. But you don't call him, honey. Mm, no married woman should call him, honey. <laughs> how funny. So how long did he, like, at his... Um, at his office, people didn't call him honey, did oh, they? No. A lot of them called him Mickey because of the being in the diamond. Uh-huh. Yeah. What, was that um, a good connotation or was that kind of bad back then to be called Mickey? Because it wasn't there kind of, kind of a slur against the Irish? No. no. In fact, a lot of people would think your name was not Michael or yeah. Mike if they called him Mickey. What was his middle name? Aloysius. Aloysius, I never knew that. How do you get that name? John A. Yeah, I just got him with John A. <laughs> Aloysius. Thank goodness no one got that name. Did he not like it? Couldn't even spell it. Really? No <laughs> like He must have got it at confirmation. You think? Yeah. A middle name at confirmation? Yeah. That's pretty funny. Honey. I wonder how he got that name. I, of course, I don't know like, who his godparents were. Maybe it was some connection there. Hmm. Maybe. Maybe, huh? Did he have any really good friends? I mean, that, that are still around today? Yes, there is. Hmm. Well, that's nice. So the, the man is like six, seven years older than him. But they were very good, and they took tests together. And, now, how far did he get on the um, fire department? Uh, he took the one for the battalion chief. Oh, yeah? Yeah. He was even sick when he took that. Mm -hmm. We didn't know it. Mm -hmm. It was a great one to study. He was studying and repeat and repeat, you know, so that he didn't forget. Yeah, that Bill McMonagall was still around. And that was his good friend? Gosh, how old is he now? He is about 91 or 92. Wow. And he was the, there also in the fire department? Yes. Do you remember who's, uh, who's in the picture with Grandpa on that um, one wall? Oh, uh, and the one on your wall? Yeah. No, I don't. No? One of them looks like somebody, but it could be the father or somebody that I know the son is. Oh. Well, that'd be interesting. Yeah, that'd be really interesting to find out who's on the back of there. How can Grandma possibly be looking at you? Why? The glare off of your clothing from the sunlight is just blinding me. Oh. Look at me, you have good eyes. I can barely see. I have to, like, shut one eye here. Do you have any questions for her? Are you asking, like, leading questions? Like, yeah. Uh, and she's answering yes, no. Oh. <laughs> Come on. I've been talking to <laughs> What was it like in 1930? 1930, that was the, the Depression years, right? One year after. 29 was the price. Yeah. Well, they went on scripts and they didn't get money. It was supposed to be as good as money, but everybody didn't take it. A lot of the money. Oh, what do you mean people didn't take it? No, uh, the telling Bill Vernon people wouldn't take it. Well, what, would they just use money, currency? Pardon? What would they use? We didn't have the money other than the script. Oh, well, then how, how did they get by? We did. We weren't so terrible. Pretty good. Oh, yeah? Only I didn't take the thing. You lost a good customer. Because <laughs> we got milk, you know. Oh, they were like a store and they didn't the take it? No. Oh. Yeah, they used to deliver the milk. They wouldn't Mark take bottle. it? They didn't believe that they'd get their money out of the I Oh, well, that's a shame. Yeah. Well, I wonder what they used to, to buy products. I wonder if they used Scrip. Those people that didn't deliver milk and take Scrip. Am I getting the story straight? I guess not. <laughs> okay, never mind. <laughs> How do you like being a movie producer? Well, you know, people are very uncooperative. Your kids, yeah. for one. They usually are. Yeah. But you need Peter and Rick here. No, they'd be even worse. They'd make a movie. Yeah. You know, I'm just trying to, you know. You know, it's too busy to position yourself in the shade. Yeah. Like being blinded there. I know. 
Karen. Did we comment on how thin Karen is? Yeah, we had on Karen. Really? Mm -hmm. 15 pounds. I'm not that thin. Be quiet. You guys are gonna be. I can hardly see you when you turn sideways. Let's suck them down. Um, I want to know about your first job. How old were you? Fourteen. Fourteen. And do you remember what you did? I, yes. I worked in the... Hey, okay, quiet on the set, you guys. Sorry. Where did you work? A mini mill. Oh, what did you do? Uh, I would examine the Do you examine the what? The sweaters. Oh, yeah. yeah. What's me? What would you look for? Did you find many flaws? Uh, some of the uh, what you call it. Well, there was one number that you never wanted to work on. It was terrible. Oh, really? You had to go back to the members so much. Then you wouldn't. They say you would say they you weren't yours when you tried to get them to what, um, were they wool sweaters or angora sweaters? No, cashmere? Well, wool. Well, that's nice. Did you get a discount on the sweaters? Could you purchase them? I forget even what we got today, but it was a place where I could walk to work. Uh-huh. Did someone get you the job? No. No? Very easy to get work. What year was that? Was this one? I was 14. 1908? No, 1916? And that was easy work there? Very. You could leave work a half a day and have another new job the next half a day. Oh. What, uh, were you not in school then, or what were you doing? Well, that was the case. Oh, uh-huh. I had to say I was 18 because I didn't have a permit to work. Uh-huh. Now, where did the child labor laws go in, in your effect? You had to be 16 to get a permit to work. Oh, uh-huh. But, uh... I went from that mini mill to a, a candy. You could candy. I didn't like it. Why didn't you like it? I, I, I can't even say why, but I didn't stay there very long. And I went back to the middle of the weekend, and the boss said to me, I know you're not it. Oh, he knew? But I, I'm not. Well, was it right after that picture was taken, your graduation picture, where you were about 14 or That was, yeah, that when the school was out. Uh-huh. So that was about that year. Yes. Yeah. Uh -huh. See, so you didn't look 18. Well, um... Well, you put on long clothes and that made you older, you know. Well, did he still hire you, even though you, he yeah. knew you weren't? Yeah. Well, that's nice. Later on, he went into on their own, uh, Seltzer brother, the lamp post that he built downtown. He was just a working in that department. Just uh -huh. He had his own place after a while. What were your hours? Did you work during the day or afternoon? Or? In the, well, like 8 to 4. Oh, uh -huh. what, um, what, at the candy place, what did you do? Sell candy or? No, I worked in the I worked where they dipped the, I didn't dip the chocolate, but you're in, a, in like a freezer. Uh-huh. Okay. And then the, the trays would come in, well, then you would pack them in the Oh, you put them in boxes already, chocolate is in and stuff? And you put, would you put them in a paper cup? Yeah. Uh-huh. So you'd work, you'd work yourself up to dip in chocolate? Okay. Was that a promotion? No, Uh huh. So, what was your next job after that? I think I went from there to uh, National Carbon. National Carbon? War work. Yeah. Oh, a riveter? No, I worked on a conveyor. What'd you do? I turned down the line. Oh, we did some soldering. Oh. Did you have to wear um, eyeglasses for that? No. To solder? No. No, but I should have worn elbow to your wrist with the oh. oh my gosh. Hey. Excuse me. Excuse me. Am I allowed to open the garage door? No. It's open. I know. Is that alright? No. We need it open. Just tell your cats not to go anywhere.
Oh, you're going to sit out front? Yeah, I'm going to walk. Okay, then there's one, one right there. there. Okay. Oh, there's one right there. So they're not in the garage anyway. She's going to miss. Make sure she doesn't go out the front. She goes out in front. She must have gone that way. She goes out in front. She knows she's hiding anyway. Right. She's hiding. She's hiding. Okay, well then, how long did you stay at the um, carbon place? Um, I stayed there till... I think the average was fine. Well, now, did you want to go back to school? Or um, after the 8th grade, did you just say, I'm not going to go to school uh, anymore? No. They do, huh? Well, now, how, for two years now, you knew you weren't supposed to be working for two years. I'm going to a bike ride. Okay, bye. Um, I still don't have a permit when I worked at the waste factory. What was that? The waste factory. Oh, in the garage? I examined here and here. Justin, don't worry about it, honey. Just walk right through. We bought a lot of them, but we never kept them. Oh. 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 O
Uh huh. Uh huh. That's nice. And you won that for being popular. For having that much money more than the one that was running against. Huh. So you got that competitive edge. Yes. The thing is, you hear stories when it's going on that, that she had sex with parties and all the girls. And she didn't. She dropped out all the time. As soon as I got started, she oh. What did you do to get all your votes? Or do, how did you get, was it you were collecting money? Is that it? No, well, they, they had parties and I, I had things to wrap them Oh, you did? Did you have to buy them? or? No, they were donated, like blankets and comforts. Oh. You go around and then my sister, she had a card thing and so much went into the pot and so much went to me. Oh. So it all amounted to like $430 or something. Oh! And at the night of the festival, this George Ebinger came over to me and he said, I know how you can get that for just like, give it $20. He knew that the other one only had $15. Oh. So you really worked your tail off. <laughs> Oh, but that wasn't much because the contest usually, he would, it wasn't much for a father or a victim because he had them where they would maybe raise a thousand dollars, you know. Well, so tell us about your wedding day then. What day did you get married? May what? May the 20th of May. 20th of May, 520. The Oh, that's kind of unusual. Was that not unusual during that time? Oh, uh, Wednesday was Wednesday. Oh, how funny. Uh -huh. At 8 o'clock in the morning. Well, then how did people take off work, or how did that work? I guess, you know, people just going back and forth on a day Yeah? Now, did you have a wedding dress? I did. I had, I didn't have a white dress. But more like, I'll tell you, when they asked Dad, what does your dress look? I said, think of coffee, but a lot of cream in it. Oh. What was it made out of? Oh, it was lace and, and uh, maybe crepe de chine. Mm -hmm. It was long waisted at the back. Mm -hmm. It was pretty. I don't know what happened to it. No. I don't know what happened to the shoes. They were shoes. Uh huh. And I was trying to be, you know, oh no, I could wear this after go wear it. Oh no, huh? Never. Never. That's like what Susan did. She never wore hers again. You can wear yours again. What? Your wedding dress? Did you do something bad, Allie? What'd you do? Tell the camera. Tell the camera what you did. Look at the camera. Come on. Come on. She's a Martian. So that's why. That's why we spank her. Because she's green hair. Look at the camera. My purple socks. That's why. Hey, where'd you guys go on your honeymoon? Going up to Grand Rapids. Taking my celebrity home. Oh my gosh. That's like um, Mary and David. Yeah. They did something like that. <laughs> did you continue to work after you were married? Did I what? Continue to work after no, you were married? We weren't allowed in that, that department. Yeah, the boss. There were other offices there that you could come back to work in. Not in his. After your marriage, you couldn't work? Oh, my God. What's the boss? The boss was there. I wonder if you could sue now for back pay. Because you could retire on that now. Real, real nicely. You could have put 30 years in. He's the only one. Other way out. Oh, precious. Ah, Mama! But it was in tough double. And I can't. I don't know. The um, how old were you when you saw it? Oh, grown up. 
Oh, and so you took your children to see it? No. Oh. Don't scare it. And there was a, was it a little kid behind yeah, you asking you questions? Maybe you couldn't see. <laughs> I was in the way. Yeah. <laughs> no, that wasn't it. But it was the same I'm question. Well, like where was mother went? Or his mother didn't die, did he? I can't remember either. Yeah. Lock that down. You have to be sitting down in order to. Who's going to play? Later.